Um, I should probably stop exploring this dungeon, but I'm... Um, might have to, I'm kind of implored to poke around here a little bit more. Okay, nothing in there. Something in here. Just kidding, that just leads elsewhere, okay. Alright, so that's pretty much nothing. But, however, there's a sign over here. Which I'm kind of inclined to read. Service ladder, use with caution. Okay. So, basically the dungeon's gonna be kind of maze-like. And the goal is to get... Oh. This is interesting. Alright. I'm digging this. Um, alright. Service ladder. Okay, so it looks like there's going to be chests hidden throughout. Stone swords really don't need them. Stone pickaxe in hindsight really don't need it. Um, okay. Moving on. We can more thoroughly explore these uh, later on. Oh, shit. Should be able to, yep, there we go, kill him. And kill that. Some gold, some torches. So, the loot, as far as I can tell, isn't spectacular. But it's loot nonetheless. So, as long as we can continue to find the service ladder just make our way down. Yep, there it is. I'm not too concerned about skipping out on some chests. I'm really honestly not. And from the looks of it, at least from the outside, doesn't look like the mazes on each level could be like super huge. So, oh, this'll be interesting. Skeletons. Not a fan. So this is... So the dungeons are essentially giant mazes filled with the occasional mob. Um, with a service ladder leading down to each new level. Uh, 64 coal, that's actually pretty valuable. I'm gonna stick with the left trick because, um, while it might seem pretty bogus, it will eventually lead you through all possible options. Um, thus meaning you'll eventually have to find the exit. <clears throat> so, consequently, just keep doing this. Yeah, that's actually okay if you blow up. Um, books. Alright. So there's a chest up there. Uh, I'll put the boots on. Might as well put the pants on. Um, the, okay, um, let's head up here. Uh, because, well, we probably should, actually. Okay, that really doesn't do anything for us, honestly. Or does it? Um, okay, so it does do something for us. Provided we can make the jumps. Leather cap. So everything's leather. Ooh, those arrows are actually really valuable for us, too. Alright, some nifty jumping, uh, wheat, we'll take it, wood, we'll take it, hello bat, um, hmm, not really sure where the next service ladder is going to be, you know, couldn't we just, oh, there it is, okay, service ladder, use with caution, alright, 
So we're just again in the kind of standard dungeon here. Um, I'm gonna go grab this chest quick and then I'll take the service ladder. Chain, bread, ladders. Uh, valuable, valuable, valuable. There we go, we'll do that. We'll head on down. Looks like we gotta break some clay here. I hear slimes, however, there's another service ladder. So we'll just keep on keeping on. Some chain, some co okay. Things are getting a little dicey, dicey now. Especially now that there's lava. Uh, it's definitely concerning. This creeper very easily could kill us. We need to be careful. I didn't realize how low my health was. Unfortunately, it's rather low. So we are going to eat some bread. And that should tide us over pretty well. Um, so there's lava above us. Coal and iron. Is it ridiculously valuable? No, not really, but it's valuable nonetheless. So that's the service ladder going up. Um, hmm. This looks like a trap if I ever saw one. Uh, we don't need the... Actually, we'll keep those to get rid of that. Uh, service ladder yet again and yet again we're in one of these bedrock and obsidian mazes of sorts I, I, they're not really mazes per se but they are actually what's over there looks interesting that is a hundred percent less interesting than I had previously imagined it was And let me guess, that service ladder just leads down there. It does. Um, and the really crappy thing about all this, too, is that we're eventually going to have to find our way back up. Um, Iron helmet. Get rid of the brick. Put the helmet on. We don't really need that helmet. Uh, feel like I'm not sure. Is this? I feel like this is the final room of the dungeon. Um. Kind of the creeper shrine of doom here, so we'll go ahead and do the. Uh, oh god, 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 god! Damn spider, calm the hell down. Thank you. Okay, so we'll just jump across here quick, break this before it spawns anything. Kill it with fire. Alright, I hear a skeleton burning. Skeletons burning is okay with me. Um, this creeper is gonna actually pathfind his way over to us. Not that big of a deal. Alright, so I think it's safe to say, I mean, we'll take a gander around here. I think it's safe to say that we've fully conquered this dungeon. Did we get all the loot from it? Almost certainly not. But needless to say, we did make it through all levels of the dungeon. Yeah, I see you over there, Mr. Skeleton. We did make it through all levels of the dungeon. At least I'm fairly confident that we did. Um, take that. Take that. Uh, we'll get rid of that, take that. Um, that's not desirable. Get 
That was a natural spawn and a half. Oh no, there was a spawner spawn. Okay. So, nothing over this way. Um, I think we've I think we've done it. Honestly, I, I really do. All right. So, I'm going to call it a wrap here. Uh, and next time we'll be fighting our way out of the dungeon as opposed to in. So, uh, thank you all for watching so very much. We're going to block that off. And um this has been Skylands with the Unknown Variable, and I'll talk to you guys later. See ya.